Hello, my beautiful people. Welcome to Fun Books and Taste Goods. And this is your host, Orlando Rosario. And today, what we are going to be doing is um, tasting the. There's a brand called Hers, H R H E R R apostrophe S. And they come with all these crazy flavors. Like every year, they just add new crazy flavors to their line. So today we are tasting cheese puffs in all different flavors. So this is what we are tasting. We are tasting um, um, bacon and cheddar um, cheese curls. We are tasting um, dip dish pizza. Um, there's mini puffs made with real cheese, um, jalapeno poppers uh, flavored cheese curls, buffalo blue cheese flavor, grilled cheese and tomato soup. Carolina Reaper pepper flavored, which I think this is gonna be my last tasting, uh, my my last one um, in the taste. Um, Old Bay um, cheese curls. Oh my God, this is like um, the baked, the normal baked cheese curls from hers. Um, honey cheese. Um, um, flavor hot cheese curls um wholeness pop and corn flavor um stops smoky you know, stops sticky sweet barbecue um flavor and stops sweet heat barbecue uh, flavor Oh my god these are a lot these are a lot so let's start with what i believe is the original which the, the normal one which is i guess this one the baked cheese curls made with real cheese and let's see so this one um Nutrition facts. So the serving size in this bag is 15 pieces, which is like 28 grams. And the calorie for those 15 pieces is 160 calories. And the sodium level, it is 280 milligrams of sodium. So let's see, let me see this. Um, so this one is just, uh, I'm trying to see where this company's from. I know it's, it's from the United States. Um, here it says it's um, the company, let me see if all of them are from, yeah, so the company is located in Nottingham, Pennsylvania. That's where the company is located. So let's see. Bait. Nope. Mm. Oh my god. These are good. They're very crunchy. Oh my god. They are delicious. Oh my God, so here it says, you can feel good about giving your family Harris, che Harris cheese curls. We use only real cheese in our special blend of natural cheddars. The curls are made from pure cornmeal and are then baked, um, not fried. So they're light and fluffy. Delicious, these are good. Oh my God, these are, these are good. I love cheese, like Cheetos and cheese curls and all that kind of stuff. It's so, so, so good. So good. So this one is Hers Hot Cheese Curls and these are not baked. So 
I think they may have one that is like that, but not baked, but I couldn't find it. Um, so this one is, the serving size is again about 15 pieces. And the calories is 150 calories. And the sodium is 430 milligrams of sodium. And again, this is gonna be, um, it says, you're going to love the twist we've put on this old favorite. Um, made from pure cornmeal and baked to a puffy perfection. Also, this, this is also baked. Yeah, it doesn't say on the on the thing here, but it's also baked. They're made from pure cornmeal and baked to a puffy perfection. Our hot cheese curls have the same crispy goodness as our regular cheese curls, but are seasoned with a special blend of savory cheeses and sizzling spices. Like all of our other quality products, they're made with only the finest ingredients. So let's see. Mm -hmm. So they look like kind of a red, more reddish in color. So that's how they look like. So let's take a bite. Oh my God. Not only is it spicy, like hot wise, it has other spices that give this unique flavor. So it's not just a hotter version of the normal cheese curls. It is that plus more because the yeah like here it says like um they are seasoned with special blend of savory cheeses and spices and you could taste that one thing i have to say even though with the spices and stuff this one is kind of saltier than the normal cheese curls like the salt level is very high. Let me just put it so you can see the back. It's high. Oh no. So that's, so all those, they're just we different. It's, it has like different, different spices, but it's delicious. Very, very good. Then this one, which I don't know exactly what I'm eating. What is this? It's called ho Hollis Puff and Corn Gluten-Free Big Cheese Flavor. Um, this one is 2.5 cups, the serving size. The calories is 150 calories and the sodium is 270 milligrams of sodium. And then here it says, Harris introduces a cheesy snack like no other. Our big cheese flavor, puff and corn, delivers the irresistible taste and texture of old fashioned cheese corn with, new, with, a, with a newfangled twist. No holes or kernels to detract from your snacking pleasure. I still, I'm still confused. I don't know what I'm, <laughs> what I'm eating, what I'm gonna be eat here. So they're different. So they look like this. So this was like popcorn, but not. It's not popcorn. So I don't know. It's just like it's a different shape. Um, that's it. Hmm. It's like a cloud very light very light and fluffy I feel like the shape is like it's a different kind of shape than a normal cheese curl they're good it's just that it is very light very very light it's like very the texture is weird. 
it is so weird bro, because it's very light and it just dissolves in your mouth and i'm confused <laughs> but it is good like it is, it is good i prefer i prefer the the other ones the hot the hot cheese curls those had a very strong flavor that one has mild it says big cheese flavored on the bag i did not find that big cheese flavor it was just a very light product like you eat it and you feel good because you're not thinking that you're eating anything heavy it's very 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 light so let me just cleanse my palate okay so now here we have um stars which is like a restaurant in texas i think austin texas and this is a sweet heat barbecue flavor and for this one is um like 15 curls is a serving size and it's 150 calories um for the serving size and the sodium is 320 milligrams so the sodium content is a little bit high um what is expected when you um eat potato chips and snacks like this the sodium is always going to be um very high that's why you have to be careful of not, not trying to eat this every day um so here it says start starts out sweet and it starts out sweet and ends with texas style heat when we set out to capture the legendary taste of texas barbecue we went right to the source when it comes to authentic texas barbecue sauce Stubbs has proven it is the real deal um her stuff's sweet heat barbecue flavored cheese curls make um, curls mix our melting your mouth cheese curls with the sweet flavor of molasses brown sugar and a touch of heat to provide one legendary snacking experience so let's see and they smell like barbecue <laughs> It smells very like barbecuey. So let's see. It's a lot of powder. It has like a lot of powder. Um, mm -hmm. Oh my god! Very unique cheese curl. Mmm. It tastes like barbecue sauce, not just by big barbecue flavor, but it tastes like an actual barbecue sauce. It is delicious. It is so good. Um, I did I did a a review on um, hot sauces, yeah, on barbecue sauces with my brother, and we cooked them over some ribs. And one of the brand was the normal version, the original version of the stubs. Um, and it was a good sauce. Oh, it does barbecue. And this is the sweet heat, and it is delicious. It is very, very, very good. Because like I said, not only has a barbecue flavor, but it also has like a barbecue sauce flavor. I don't know if you um, try, I don't, I don't know if I'm explaining it correctly, but, but it is good. Then we have this one, which is not, this is the sweet heat, but then we have another one, which is sticky, sticky sweet sticky sweet flavor of the same of the, of the same brand of stops barbecue sauce um and this one is also the serving size is 15 curls and the calorie is 150 calories and the sodium is 320. and here it says barbecue has never been so sweet when we set out to capture the legendary sticky sweet and savory taste of texas barbecue we went right to the source when it comes to authentic texas barbecue sauce stops has proven it is the real deal the mixture of our melting your mouth cheese curls with the texas bars barbecue taste of stop sticky sweet barbecue sauce makes for our one legendary snacking experience so let's see They look identical they look the same they look very like a lot of powder 
and the cheese curls but this one is supposed to be sweet let's let it see mm. oh my god i don't know how they do it but it, you, it's like you're eating barbecue sauce It is good, it is sweet, you could taste the sweetness, but it also is very salty, which is confusing because I would expect it to be more sweet, but um, this it's, it has a hint of sweetness, and it's usually at the beginning, like when you, put, when you first put the curl in your mouth, you are going to feel like a sweetness to it. But then once you start chewing it, then it becomes very salty. It is good. It is, I prefer the sweet heat because again, like the, the heat taste, the, the kick of heat, it's good. It is very delicious, it's very good. Oh my God, we only have done five. And there's so many others. Let's try this one. So this is um, honey cheese flavored curls. And it is again, 15 curls is the serving size and it is 150 calories. And the, col and the sodium is 270 milligrams of sodium. Then it's what's all the buzz about hers honey cheese curls? It seems people who try this phenomenal flavors combination get all stung with excitement. Hey, why be left out? And B, of course, is B-E-E -E left out. Join the sworn of cheese curls lovers who have discovered how much fun is when you make hers yours. So let's see. then they taste like nothing but let so that's how so it has just a normal cheese kind of um yellowish red um orangey um color so let's see how it tastes mm. Oh my God, these are so good. This, the honey, it's like it has this sweet honey taste. See, in the sticky sweet stops barbecue, I was expecting sweet and it became very salty. This one, it is sweet. And then instead of salty, it becomes cheesy. This is delicious. Oh my God, this is so good. See, so as soon as you bite it, as soon as it spreads all over your tongue, a very nice, sweet honey flavor. Mm. This one, it is delicious. Honey cheese. Good job. Oh my God, that's one of my favorites so far because it is so distinctive and the flavors are very good. Oh my God, that this is very good. So now is bacon and cheddar. So bacon and cheddar flavor. And this one is also 15 pieces on the serving size and the calorie is 160 calories for those 15 pieces. And the sodium is also 320 milligrams. And it says, um, mm, bacon. Hers presents a sizzling new twist on the classic cheese curl. Hers bacon cheddar flavored cheese curl delivers the unmistakable flavor of smokehouse bacon combined with a creamy sharp tang of fresh cheddar for a taste you can't refuse and a crunch you can't 
resist. Like all of our her snacks, bacon cheddar flavored cheese curls are made from the choiciest ingredients available and delivered fresh to your snacking pleasure. Let's see. Mm. Mm. It doesn't have a strong smell. So that's how they look like. Just have the same, the same color, the uh, cheesy color. So let's see. Mmm. Mmm. I don't. I don't taste the bacon. Where's the bacon? I cannot, I cannot taste the bacon. The only thing I can taste is the cheese, like a normal cheese curl. Mm. If, if the bacon flavor, cause I'm trying to look for like this, so, it's not good when you try to look for a flavor that is being promised and you keep trying and trying and trying to look for it and it's not there. I can say that there's an aftertaste of it's like bacon bits. But I don't know if that's just my mind tricking me because I know I'm trying. I'm trying because I'm trying to get it. I'm trying to look for a flavor that is not there, and now I'm like, well, maybe like the aftertaste is kind of bacony, but it's not really. No, like I don't. Very disappointed in the bacon cheddar. I don't taste the bacon because for the other ones, I have tasted the ingredients that is being promised in the back. I have tasted them, but here the bacon, I don't taste the bacon at all. So, very disappointed in the bacon cheddar because I love bacon. Bacon is, that should be its own food group because it is delicious. Sorry vegans out there, but I feel so sorry for you vegans because bacon is like heaven on earth. <laughs> um, so here we have bacon, uh, see, <laughs> bacon is in my head. Buffalo blue cheese. So this is a buffalo blue cheese flavor and I love buffalo wings. I love buffalo wings with blue cheese. Love them. That's my favorite snack appetizer at restaurants. So this one is again, let me see, 15 pieces is the serving size, 150 calories and the sodium is 340. And it says Ch change is good. Everyone knows cheese curls are cheddar, but at Hairs we are breaking the rules to bring you a snack sensation. Buffalo blue cheese flavor curls. We combine classic hot wing sauce and tangy blue cheese to create the perfect balance of spicy goodness. You're going to love, you're going to love this change. So, smell wise, it has that stinky blue cheese smell. They are cheesy. They're still very cheesy looking. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You can taste the blue cheese. It has a blue cheese flavor to it. So it's a cheese curl and then the aftertaste and everything like when you first put it in your mouth is blue cheese. Mm. It is delicious, especially if you love blue cheese. I love blue cheese so much that after I finish all my wings and there's blue cheese left. 
by my finger I keep eating <laughs> the blue cheese until it was, it's all gone because I love blue cheese so much this is good very good mm -mm. so it has that blue cheese flavor which is good because that's what it's telling me so I'm still upset with the bacon mm. Um, now this one is deep dish pizza flavor and this one is uh, for 15 pieces it's 160 calories and the sodium is 330 and then it says hers takes the cheese curl to a new heights and depths or deep dish pizza flavor curls combine the crackling crisp classic cheese curls with the savory seasonings and old world flavor of traditional Chicago style dip dish pizza. Um, and they say, yeah, 330 milligrams and 160 of sodium and 160 calories. Okay. Like, I don't, I don't, the cheese, cheese curls, they don't have like a good aroma. Like if you look for the aroma, it's not really good aroma. But that's how they look like. Mmm. That's like a, oh my God, like a pack, like a bunch of flavors all together in your mouth. It tastes like like pizza. It tastes like pizza, but in a different kind of pizza. It's like a pizza casserole, but again, I think deep dish pizza is basically like a pizza casserole because it's so deep that you have to eat it with a fork um, a knife and fork and stuff like that. This is good. It has like like spices you put on it on the on a pizza sauce. Like um, I don't know if it's oregano and it has. It is delicious. It is good. It has this classic tomato paste kind of flavor with oregano and with cheese and that combination just tastes like pizza it is good it is very good see i love when i taste what is being promised good so this is good as well so now let's try let's go simple and let's try the normal the mini puffs so these are the um, herbs, uh, the mini puffs. And for this one is, um, oh my gosh, serving size. That's a lot. It's 81. 81 mini puffs is one serving size and that's 160 calories. But it's not that bad for 81 mini puffs for 160 calories. And the sodium is 280 milligrams. So this says mini, pu mini puffs, but um, huge in flavor. See? and they're little but they're not yeah but not that little little but they are so those any one of those is a serving size let's see hmm they're good they're very crunchy Mmm, they're very cheesy, very crunchy. Um, but for some reason, it doesn't taste like the big, big cheese curls. There are the texture; they taste almost the same, but texture-wise, is different. This one is crunchy but hollower I 
and that one is fluffy I don't know fluffier I don't know they're good they are very good it's just that they're just plain they're normal normal cheese cheese puffs they're, they're just normal now let's try blah 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 let's try this one this try is this is the old bay old bay seasoning and i live here in maryland and this is a very um well-known brand because um the crabs here in maryland um the seasoning that they use for the maryland crab is old bay um and um this one says well it's 15 pieces and it's 160 calories for those 15 pieces and the sodium is 370 and it says the older the better cheese curls with genuine old bay ever since crabbers on the chesapeake discovered the distinctive blend of spices known as old bay folks have been sprinkling it into foods of all kind only hers brings authentic old bay seasoning to snack foods um, here we continue or oh, here we combine savory old bay with real cheese flavor in a cheese curl that's sure to be classic for generations to come so I don't know because this is old bay I don't know if this old bay um, cheese curl is available throughout the United States I am not sure um, but this is all based very Maryland it's very very it's a staple of the whole Chesapeake Bay area um, see. oh my god as soon as you open it the old bay oops that aroma that smell of old bay is present it is right there it hits you in your face when you open the bag so this is how they look like. Let's see. Mm -hmm. All day is delicious. Mm. This is so delicious. It just reminds me of crabs. Automatically, when I taste Old Bay, it just reminds me of seafood and crab and stuff like that. It is so good. Oh my God, if you have never tried Old Bay, which I'm pretty sure Old Bay is available all throughout the United States. Um, uh, maybe the 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 way it's used may differ. Here is a lot for crab cakes and crabs, but I, I have seen people in my work that they put into the French fries. Um, I think if you are born and raised in Maryland, which I am not, I was born and raised in Puerto Rico and raised in Connecticut, um, and also raised in Connecticut. Um, the you may use it in um, um, differently, but here in Maryland, if you're born and raised here, um, you will put all day in everything. Mmm. It's good. Very strong all day flavor, and it tastes like all day. So these are delicious. These are very good. Then we have. Let me cleanse my palate on that one because that's strong flavor. Okay, so this one is grilled cheese and tomato soup flavors. And this one is again 15 pieces and 160 calories and the sodium is 260 um, milligrams of sodium. And it says, just like mom used to make, we invite your mouth to encounter the creamy goodness of buttery grilled cheese combined with a comforting richness of tomato soup this is the snack experience that you will be sure to take your taste buds down memory lane in fact you may even call mom after 
afterwards because um, tomato soup and grilled cheese is a very American culture staple um I think I have high, high hopes for this because those two flavors are classic it's just like a classic combination of those two flavors and I love tomato soup and I love grilled cheese so I hope this does not disappoint me like the bacon cheddar did I hope this actually has those flavors so let's see mmm it smells kind of sweet it's weird it has like a sweet um, um, smell let's see Mm -hmm. Oh my god. It tastes more like tomato soup than grilled cheese. Mm. Oh my god, these are so... It's true. It brings you back to memory lane because automatically the, the the tomato soup flavor that is here it is it tastes like the classic tomato soup it is good mm -hmm. oh my god this is delicious i am so surprised this is good unfortunately the grilled cheese i think just the cheese flavor in general that makes it up for the grilled cheese because i will not know how a grilled cheese flavor will be like on a cheese curl but what makes it interesting is that strong tomato soup flavor that this cheese curl has and it is delicious so if you like tomato soup this is good oh my god it's very vegetably tomato we it is delicious it's very good i recommend this one too very very good two more to go and we'll be done so the next one is the jalapeno poppers jalapeno poppers and this is for 15 pieces is 150 calories and 340 milligrams of um, sodium and it says, bite into one of our delicious Hearst Jalapeno Poppers flavored cheese curls and eat my return the flavor because behind this bag, cheddar cheesy flavor is a zesty little pinch of jalapeno pepper that packs a little zing. Don't say we didn't warn you. So is this gonna be like spicy? Because then after this one, I have the Carolina Reaping Pepper. So I, I guess I left the, the, the two spiciest for the end. Let's see. Let's see my... Okay. Mmm, it has a pepper taste. I, the pepper taste, a pepper, a pepper smell. Mmm. And you could feel, you could see the pepper stuck into the cheese curls. So that's how they look like you see some blacks I don't know if you can see it well there on the camera but it has like the cheese girl has like black peppers I'm um, stuck in them mm -mm. let's see mm -hmm. Mm. oh my god this is so good Mm, 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 mm. this is delicious it has actually it does taste like jalapeno poppers it has a, um, a strong jalapeno popper your jalapeno pepper taste but it just tastes like when the jalapeno pepper is cooked 
because raw jalapeno peppers taste completely different than when they are cooked. And this is like a cooked version of that flavor of jalapeno pepper. And it is delis delicious. Um, usually when I order jalapeno poppers at restaurants, it is the jalapeno, but inside it's cream cheese. Um, it's not cheddar cheese. So this is a different, a little bit different jalapeno popper flavor for me um, because it's just the jalapeno pepper cooked but with cheddar cheese it is still delicious it is good this is delicious this is good I like it so now let's it is this one the California Reaper flavor and this one is 15 curls, is 150 calories, and the sodium is 390. And then it says, when it comes to heat, it is off the chart. The Carolina Reaper is currently the hottest pepper around, boasting over 1,500,000 Scoville heat units, SHU. This mighty pepper set the standards for hot. Hers has accepted this flavor challenge by combining the heat of the Carolina Reaper pepper with the savory goodness of our classic cheese curls to bring you the hottest snack items we have ever made. Whew, oh my god. Mm. scared it doesn't smell like you know like when you smell hot sauce or, the, or like hot peppers like even by you smelling it you know it's, you, you you're gonna die <laughs> that you, you know that yeah you are gonna be there for an experience of death <laughs> this one doesn't it's not, the, so the, the the smell is not like that so which is okay for me because I don't want to die either and so this is how they look like I'm nervous because I have heard that the Carolina Reaper pepper is very hot. Let me put this here and let me have the water here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm. Whew, mm-hmm. Oh yeah. Oh my God, mm-hmm. Um, ah. Uh, oh my God, it has a very strong taste. When you first put it in your mouth, the taste is delicious and you think it's not gonna burn you but when you swallow it this whole thing right here and the back of your tongue you feel that heat kicking it's not horrible i think it's gonna be hotter to be honest but i think they have to make it that way so it's enjoyable for a snack for cheese curls because if you're gonna have a cheese curl that you can only eat one and that's it it's not good for the company anyway so they want you to eat more of them so it is good it's not bad at all let me eat another one uh, it's good mm -hmm. all right it's very the flavor is very good when you first put it in your mouth I think the hitness comes after you swallow after you swallow, I'll say like now, now I can see, I can, I can feel it on my throat and the back of my tongue. But it is not a horrible heat, it's tolerable, you can handle it, um, it's good, it's good, it is delicious. Oh my god, there are so many cheese curls here that I love. 
I can say that I love the jalapeno popper. That was amazing, this one. This one was delicious, the jalapeno poppers. And I, seriously, I love this one, the honey cheese. Honey cheese was so good. That was very good. My least favorite has to be this one because I did not taste the bacon. This is the only one from all of these that I did not taste what the bag said. I tasted every single flavor that the bag is actually telling me. This one, the bacon, nothing, nada, no, nada. No probé el bacon. <laughs> uh, no, no me supo a nada. It, I, it, didn't, it, it didn't taste like anything. I swear, it just did not taste like bacon. It just tasted like a normal cheese curl to me. So no fue muy bueno. But the rest are delicious. They are good. So I, I don't know if this brand is available also throughout the United States. I'm not sure. So if you see it, um, um, just look for other weird flavors because they have, I'm gonna do another different taste test with the Hers brand potato chips, which the flavors are crazy. And they also have a Hers um, brand of popcorn, which I'll also be doing that soon. Um, so this brand is on steroids. This brand just keeps making odd flavors and, um, and I love it because I love trying new things. So once again, um, I hope you like the video. If you want me to try something, just post it in the comments and I will, because I read all my comments and I reply to all of them. So if you um, want me to taste something, just let me know and I will go buy the stuff and do a taste video and just, you know, give you a shout out, mention your name, stuff like that. So please like my channel. Please share my channel with your family and friends. Subscribe and stay safe. God bless you. I love you all. Take care. Bye-bye.